Hi guys, uh, this is Forex. I'll be explaining Nasdaq here how to trade Nasdaq. You can also use the strategy to trade your uh, other pairs of your indices, not only Nasdaq. Understand? So, guys, you have to click on moving average. Remember, guys, uh, it's, it's the similar settings with the technical strategy. Uh, I won't uh, go back and forth explaining like how to to add your moving averages but these are the numbers of course by now if you you started by the technical video you'll understand these numbers make sure guys uh it's a blue color then on your parameter the 161 must be red of course then you click ok ok guys on nasdaq this is what you do it's simple as you can see it's a bit different in terms of the, the structure you understand it's because that nasdaq is not a currency paid in this so most of your indices will be like this you understand guys so here guys uh this is how you implement it uh when you buy when you buy uh let's go back can you spot the signal let's go back so that you can Get a clear picture. Okay, guys, let's start here. So, guys, you need to make sure, as you can see, the price is dropped here. Ne? Then they went back to visit our area. So, guys, every time. When the prices dropped or maybe when they went up and it happened that this candle closes above the second last e EMA as you can see here it closed here it's a signal that on the next candle you have to buy so before this other candle forms as soon as this candle closes you're going to buy here understand then guys remember your stop losses must always be below the blue line meaning most of your stop loss will be here understand just below just below your blue line understand just below few pips below Doesn't matter if you are buying or selling, it must always be below or above. Understand? When you are buying, obviously, it will be somewhere here. It's an example. It will be somewhere here. Understand? This is uh, your blue line, then it will be above. Then, if it's a sell, it will be here. Understand? I hope you get what I'm saying. So, guys, then you, 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 to take profit guys we use a trailing stop meaning let's say as we can see the price shoot up understand your prices shoot up then it went down a bit your retrenchment that's where or your retest that's where you 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 put your trailing stop understand so you'll we'll put it somewhere here understand so let's also see the next signal as you can see guys prices were dropping here prices were dropping and they went up again as you can see it closed but here guys i won't suggest you to buy or to enter the trade but however you can still enter it it's safe it closes above this blue line here the la the second last blue line understand then of course you have to buy but as you can see the candle was too was too powerful it closed above the last blue line but however you can still buy understand you can still buy it was a good buy as you can see you see here guys you do not enter do not enter when you see this 
never closed uh, above the second last line so you do not enter you just ignore the trade as you can see here guys it was a clear signal too you see here it closed below the blue line as you can see guys it went smoothly smoothly down for days understand for days let's go back to test here's a buy too guys as you can see prices were dropping and the candle closed above this blue line here it was a sign to buy again as you can see here the prices were selling again it closes below the blue line it was a signal for you to buy remember your stop loss is always above the blue line so your stop loss is going to be somewhere here remember guys this strategy works on any time frame but i recommend it on 5 minutes and 15 minutes if you wanna uh, close your trades daily then you can trade on your 5 minutes or your 15 minutes then if you wanna be a long term trader you can trade from 1 hour but it will take time for you to enter the trade to understand guys it's very simple i hope you understand how to trade your nasdaq now and your currency remember guys uh let me let me rephrase again after adding the the indicators and stuff when prices ne, when prices closes below the second last moving average here it's a signal to to sell understand vice versa when you are buying i hope you understand guys it's not a difficult strategy you do not need sorry you do not need any uh much knowledge on trading itself if you wanna research more about forex about your candlesticks and stuff then you can do that on your own but the strategies are here to help you to make money apply the strategies make sure you follow the rules do not uh do not trade what you think trade what you see follow what i have told you it's very simple guys now you can see by now with that this thing is very simple but it's very powerful test it out you'll see how powerful it is but however guys it has uh these advantages sometimes the strategy might i mean the market might not obey the strategy but most of the time you're going to win when trading the strategy when using this formula this is your nasdaq strategy you understand guys then guys on your fundamental strategy on your nasdaq uh half pass yeah it depends uh with the seasons but normally it's half past three some uh then, yeah it's half past three normally but for now i think it's it's half past four you can implement the same strategy you will see uh where where the price is so let's say the price is here let's say the price is here before half past four it's a signal to sell you're going to sell at half past four still but however it's a risky guys because it can blow your account in just a second so always use proper risk management and do not the risk money you cannot afford to lose understand the forex carries high level of risk and please do not risk what you cannot afford to lose understand have a successful trading chain i hope you understand keep this strategy to yourself uh remember guys if brokers know what we are doing you won't be able to make money anymore so keep this to yourself and make money. Thank you.